dance, and often Indian dancing has been thought of as just kids jumping around, but you'll notice that these fellas that have had Indian Lord Merit Badge and have studied Indian dancing have a particular step that they're following. And each movement, and as the Indians practice this, then of the group, someone who did it maybe better than the others was selected to do a solo dance. And this is the one you're going to see next. It's called the Eagle Dance. And in the Eagle Dance, it symbolizes the Indian nation that when the red men first were in America, however they got there, they had the whole country pretty much to themselves. And the first part of the dance expresses the free spirit of the Indian. And the soaring and the gracefulness of the eagle. But then, with the coming of the white man and the hunting of the buffalo and the usurping of their land, why the Indian spirit is broken. And this is symbolized by the eagle being shot and wounded and then is falling to the earth. Later, there is a recovery as the American Indian sort of lived in harmony to a degree with the white man on their reservation. In fact, it's my understanding that today there are more Indians in the United States than they were when the colonists got there. Of course, there's more uh, colonists there too, in a sense. But then the recovery of the Indian, and that signifies the uh, free spirit of the Indian, and it's uh, the, the spirit of the Indian in the eagle that flies on to the end.